Hi, my name is Andrew Kandel. I'm the Global Chief Compliance Officer for Cerberus Capital Management and a lecturer in law at the University of Pennsylvania Law School. Hi, my name is Lauren Steinfeld. I'm the Chief Privacy Officer for Penn Medicine and also a lecturer in law at the University of Pennsylvania Law School. Every organization, every industry and profession has to deal with compliance. In fact, even people in their personal lives deal with compliance in one form or another, some on a daily basis, some in a more formal setting. Some compliance requirements are industry specific and may come from that industry standard rather than a specific law, rule, or regulation. In this course, we'll learn the fundamentals of compliance and explore the concepts, considerations, and strategies for assessing risk and managing compliance within all types of organizations, from startups to multinational corporations. We'll discuss techniques and tools for developing and managing compliance programs and creating an effective compliance structure within an organization. We'll learn about why compliance is important, from the needs facing businesses in highly regulated industries to avoiding fines and penalties, and to preventing reputational and economic nightmares. Looking at real examples of compliance and governance failures and the impact that they've caused, we will discuss the good, the bad, and the ugly. We'll talk about the Sarbanes-Oxley Act of 2002, a law that significantly strengthened corporate governance. That act was a direct response to certain compliance failures, specifically the corporate accounting frauds at Enron, Tyco, WorldCom, and other companies. And we'll also discuss the Dodd-Frank Wall Street Reform and Consumer Protection Act that was passed in response to the 2008 global financial crisis. Compliance isn't only about preventing problems and ensuring that everyone's abiding by the required laws, rules, and regulations. We'll also learn about the positive impact a robust and ethical compliance program can have on a business, as well as how the concepts of compliance and risk management are inextricably intertwined.